<laughs> it was good. I was I was a little surprised, but uh, always a good honor to, to receive. I was just happy to, to get it. Keep hoping the coach is going to call your number sometime. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm ready to do whatever they need me to do, whether it's, it's blocking or catching, receiving, running the ball, whatever. So. I know offensive linemen have that job every play. You know, being a guy lines up in the backfield just seems like it would be natural. So, man, I, you know, I'm not here ready. Uh, I'm more of an offensive lineman <laughs> than, a, than a back, but it's just whatever the team needs I'm, I'm willing to do. What was your anticipation coming into the year about how much you would play? Uh, I expected to, to do about what I've done, just being there on, on the two back sets and about, about what I expected. Obviously, as a pretty smart guy, you're going to have some options for yourself after college. What do you see yourself doing? I, uh, I'm actually, I want to be a financial advisor, I believe, so going to gonna work on that route. This, this is what the plan is as of now, though. We'll, we'll see. It could always change. Have you spoken to any of your teammates who are going to happen to come into some final? <laughs> <laughs> I have not. So hopefully they'll remember me when they when they get the, that big check. But, How hard is it to replace a guy like Pat DeMarco? Uh, very hard. He, he was a good player. Pat, everybody knows Pat was extremely good, great leader on this team, and it's not so much trying to replace him, but just trying to do my part and fill in wherever they needed me. Thanks, Tom.